A singer has signed for one of the biggest record labels. Oh, I wish I was a punk rocker with flowers in my hair. It's Sandy Tom. She's 24 and she lives in Tooting in South London. Her debut single is this year's biggest hit, spending a record 10 consecutive weeks at the very top of the charts. Her debut album, Smile, It Confuses People, has already taken the UK by storm as a number one album and it's now grabbing the attention of industry insiders and fans right here in the US. But now, thanks to the internet, she is an international success. It's a great story. Her album and her single hit number one in the UK. This album is really, um, it's a collection of songs that, you know, I have written over the past couple of years that really represent the changes in my life, both personally and professionally, and how I've evolved as a musician. It's really a new beginning for me. You know, I wanted to use people, use musicians, use a producer, use a location that was all completely new to me. And Rich wanted to record the record in Nashville because a lot of the players we use are all based in Nashville. Um, Steve Gorman, the drummer from The Crows, Audley, who was you know, an ex-guitar player from The Crows, um, Mike Webb, who you know has played with a, a multitude of, of people. Um, you know, and it's so, so it was a great cast of characters and they're all based in Nashville, basically. So we went to the 16 Ton Studios, you know, famous studio, recording studio, and it's great. It's one of those places that you set up a, a mic in the bathroom, you know, it was the, every room is utilised in terms of space and, and, and sound. So it's really organic, if you like. So the deal's already made. Well, Buffy was a was a wild card. I mean, I you know I wanted to cover a Buffy song because I've always been a big fan. And as a little girl who was very shy and conscious, self-conscious, and didn't you know couldn't really speak out, it was my when I heard her sing, it was the one moment in life that I realized that I could have a voice. So you know, for her, literally, she's legitimately the reason why I became a singer-songwriter. You know, so to have her walk into a room with me and sing her song with me that I've loved for decades is like, it's, it's, it's too surreal for words, you know? You know, I think that, you know, hopefully I can continue to create music that invites new fans always along the way. I like to be able to do something that's, di that's different each time and new and refreshing and, you know, offers up a different take on things. But at the same time, I think with my closest fans, you know, are my friends, really, um, have been on this journey with me anyway and hopefully I think the ones that know me most will get why these, you know, these songs and where I've been coming from. <laughs> 